All right, guys, welcome back to another weekly update. Today is Monday. You will be seeing this on Tuesday, but it's about 6 p.m., and I'm going to jump right into this. BrickCon is a Lego convention that's going on this coming weekend. I'll be there Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. It's in Seattle, Washington, in the United States, and I go to this every year. I've been going to this for probably five, no, it's been more like seven years, actually, but I've been vending there for the past five let's see, four or five years, I'd say. And so basically what that means is I'll be bringing all my products, everything that's on bricktactical.com will be going to that Lego convention and you guys can come check it out, see it in person and purchase it. So for example, this is kind of my weapons bin. So you can see we've got the Glock 18s, we've got the Shorty 12Gs, we've got the shotgun shells, we've got the new Arasakas, M16s, AK-47s, all these weapons and accessories will be coming to BrickCon. And what I'm mostly excited about is all of these figures down here that were normally out of stock on the website, but they are finally back in stock. So I'm going to go go ahead and go through these real quick for you guys. So I talked about these on an Instagram live stream, but for those that don't look at my Instagram, I'm going to talk about them here on YouTube. So basically, we've got a version 2, I'm going to call it, of the U.S. Marine. Now, this is a figure that I've been selling for a while. But uh, I went ahead and kind of redid it. It's got a new head. It's got short sleeves instead of just all sand green arms. It comes with a rifle this time, and it comes with an overmolded cigarette. So I have 10 of these. These will be going. This is kind of a new figure. Here's a restock. We have a World War I German soldier. So we've got 20 of those. We've got a restock of the Lunar Hero minifigure. So we've got 20 of those coming as well. So once again, once everything, let's see, how do I want to say this? After BrickCon, all of this stuff will be on the website. So for those that aren't going to BrickCon that still want some of this stuff, whatever's left, I will put on the website the following Monday, which I believe is October 7th. So next up, we've got some Flame Troopers. These are the World War I Flame Troopers from Battlefield 1. A lot of you guys have been missing these. These have been out of stock for a while. I have 10 of them here. I'm working on another set of 10. I'm just waiting on one more piece to come in from a BrickLink order. So those are coming. I just restocked more of my Olive Green Space Marines that use my Halo armor. So those are really cool. I'm really excited to bring those back. We've got kind of the army builder version of the British soldier. So this guy's only $10 and he's fully printed there. So uh, I think there's 20 of those as well. Then down here, this kind of goes with the US Marine that I showed you guys is the World War II Japanese soldier. So I only have 10 of these and uh, I know these are gonna sell fast because these are only $10 and these are probably one of my most popular Pacific themed minifigures. So 10 of those, those will be coming to BritCon. Next up, we've got my World War I British soldiers. Once again, another popular World War I figure. 20 of those as well. This is a, a really cool product that I'm excited about. This is a brand new product. This is what I'm calling the Brick Mag. Basically what it is, is it's a custom CNC machined aluminum Lego brick. And then I put in some magnets on the back. And if you can see, if I flip it upside down there, it says Brick Tactical, made in the USA. So they're just like fridge magnets, or if you have like a whiteboard that's magnetic, just some kind of cool magnet. They'll be $10 for two of them. So I just thought it was something different. So I got, I think there's 15 total in here. So this is kind of the first batch. I'm curious to see what you guys think of these. I know I've talked about these on a weekly update, I think a couple weeks ago. So I'm curious to see how these sell. So let me know what you guys think of those. If you get those at BrickCon, once again, if these don't sell out, they'll be on um, the website bricktactical.com after the LEGO convention. Next up, we've got explosive packs. These have been out of stock for a year or so, so these are finally back in stock. You get a custom printed crate, and then you've also got a C4 tile, M16, and then you get four grenades, two flashbangs, two frag grenades. So there's 20 of those in this bin, and those will be coming as well. Next up, another one of my favorites. This is the new version of the World War II American. So he's got a new custom printed face. He comes with an M1 Grand this time, and he comes with a cigarette that's overmolded. So these are probably gonna sell out very quickly. There's 20 of these, and uh, I don't know the price yet for these. You know, normally this would be a $15 figure, but I added the cigarette and the gun, so maybe $20, but I'm probably gonna keep it to 15 and see how quickly they sell. Next up, we've got, for all the Fallout fans, we've got Pit-Boy. I made another batch of like 20 of those. 
This one's kind of a funny figure just because calling him Little Smoke. So if you guys are for adults only, you've got this guy with a custom printed torso and a custom overmolded um, accessory, let's just say that. Next up, we've got 20 Red Hoods. This is another popular, one of my superhero kind of lineups. So we've got 20 of those. Those are really cool. And then we've also got this guy, which is the classic World War II American soldier. And now he comes with a rifle. So he used to not come with a rifle. He'll come with a rifle and he'll still be the same price of $15. So once again, I'm trying to add more accessories, you know, and weapons to these guys to make them more valuable. Um, and just add value to the overall figure. So I hope you guys are enjoying that. So like I said, all of these figures will be coming to BrickCon. Whatever doesn't sell will be going on the website afterwards. So those are kind of the new figures and the restocks. Then obviously I'll be bringing the weapons. If we go in here in my inventory kind of room, like all these custom printed tiles will be coming. All of these weapons. My Halo armor will be coming, like all the new energy swords, the RPGs, all that stuff will be coming. All the meme heads, the troll faces, all that stuff will be coming, custom legs, torsos, all of that so you guys can build figures or you can just get individual parts. All of that will be coming along with like the anti-aircraft guns, Mark V mystery packs, plate lockers, weapons packs, custom hats, t-shirts, explosive specialists. Spartan pack, SWAT, you know, everything you can think of will be coming to BrickCon. All of this stuff here you see, we got French soldiers, Russian recons, Ottoman scouts. We also have these custom printed brick badges with my logo on them, which I think are really cool. All that stuff will be coming. I also re restocked the uh, perk machines along with the perk colas. So if you guys want those, because then now that I have, as I drop that, I've got all of these are back in stock. So we've got Speed Cola, Juggernaut, etc., 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 Pack-a-Punch, all of that stuff will be coming along with like the American minifigures. We got, you know, Assault, only got one left of him. We've got some Engineers. So lots of stuff is coming to BrickCon. It's one of my favorite conventions because it is local to me and uh, I have a lot of buddies that go to it. So I'm really excited. I hope you guys come out. If you guys come out, make sure you come up to me and talk to me. Like I said, I'll be there Friday, which is like the private attendees day. Then Saturday and Sunday is open to the public for, I believe, I don't know how many hours. I think it just ends at four. But uh, definitely check it out. Go to BrickCon.org. Check out the details. Buy your tickets ahead of time. And like I said, if you find me, just find the Brick Tactical booth. You'll see this banner and come find me. Come talk to me. If you guys want me to take a picture with you, sign your t-shirt, sign whatever you want, I will definitely do that. So definitely come up and find me. Talk to me. I love talking to you guys. And uh, yeah, other than that, I hope to see you guys there. And then I will be doing my video on Thursday, which will probably be a minifigure review or something like that. And then Sunday, you'll see another Vietnam video. So just keep an eye out for those two videos as well. But uh, just know that I will be at BrickCon this weekend. So other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. Thanks for the support, and I'll see you guys at BrickCon.